So the insiders of this future nanomaterial producer, Quartomic, keep buying shares at a pretty insane pace too. Actually, the CEO of the company is now holding more than 3 million shares across his two different accounts, which he all bought from open markets and options I should add. But this most recent buy, an exercise of stock options for $0.5 per share by Arno Brands, filed just yesterday. Well, this buy baffles me. I really had to think long and hard why Arno Brand would do this transaction. After all, he effectively bought shares for 50 cents a share, while the company was trading at just 40 cents on the open market. But of course, I do have some potential reasons as to why Arno Brand might do this. Let me explain. Stock options. You see, these stock options work like this. Kratomek one day was like, hey, Arno Brand, CEO boy, you are doing a pretty good job. So here you have some stock options where you can buy a handful of Cortomic shares for 50 cents a share from us directly whenever you desire up until the expiration date. And that transaction where a company gives their management and employees stock options is a pretty normal occurrence in the Stonks world. So this isn't what baffled me. What did baffle me is that Arno Brand bought his shares whilst options were still out of the money. Meaning there was no real financial incentive to do this transaction. After all, he would have been able to buy more shares with the same amount of money on the open market. Moreover, these options weren't planned to expire at least until the end of December this year. So from a time and money perspective, he didn't need to do this transaction. Actually, from a first glance, it seems like a pretty stupid trade from his end. However, I do promise there are a couple of logical reasons as to why Arno Brand might have gone through with the stock option exercise. Reason number one, Arno Brand wanted to put his cash into the balance sheet of the company. After all, if you purchase shares of a company on the open market, that money is effectively lost to the company. But if you buy shares through stock options you received from the company, that cash goes straight into the balance sheet of the company. So maybe Arno Brand wanted a second purpose of his money. One, being the owner of these new shares, and two, putting a small cash infusion into the company. Reason number two, maybe, potentially, Arno Brand is in a blackout period. You see, insiders aren't allowed to trade shares right before and right after a pretty significant news release. This is a law implemented by the SEC, aimed to prevent insiders from gaining an unfair edge in the markets. So maybe, we do not know this for sure, but maybe Arno Brand isn't allowed to buy shares on the open market right now. But insiders are allowed to actually exercise options even during a blackout period. So maybe Arno Brand wants to increase his share position legally right before a big news release. Reason number three, the last reason I can think of, maybe this is just a public vote of confidence. Perhaps Arno Brand just wants to publicly reinstate his confidence in the company. And what better way of doing that than putting your money where your mouth is? By buying even more shares of the company that you run. Perhaps it is a combination of all three reasons, or it might just be an entirely different reason altogether. The only way for us to know for sure is by asking Arno Brand directly. Until then, all these reasons are just speculation but they are fun speculation. I do want to remind you, it is quite rare for insiders to exercise options which are out of the money. Meaning this transaction is for sure peculiar. So I'm gonna just end this video with this. There are infinite reasons for insiders to sell shares, but there's just one for insiders to buy shares. And that, that is because these insiders believe the company is actually undervalued. With that said, thank you so much for watching. I love you all. Peace.